So, we're out doing some cash maintenance and driving by a couple caches and I need some caches for uh, to get the 500 points for the uh, cache labyrinth. So, I already got 285 points. There's a cache out there. Let's go see if we can find it. So, let's stop, grab the cache here. And this kind of looks suspicious, so I opened it up. Opened here and moved the rat. Uh, rock here and look eek it's a rat on the bottom rat is a log container another cache location here I see a bit of a geo trail going to this tree hopefully it's a nice quick find Ooh, peanut butter jar love the peanut butter jars easy finds uh, I can get it. Around here. Yep. A little monkey go. Box in the container. I'm having serious problems. I had to go get the tweezers to get the log out of this thing. I had the twe tweezers to get the logs out of that rat. Lots of swag in this one. Some days you shouldn't get out of bed. Put the cash back. Go back to the truck and put my hand in the pocket. And there's the free log container in my pocket. So back to grab the cash. Put the log back. Oh, still got maintenance to do today, but it's supposed to rain at noon. Not quite noon, but there's a few drops on me. But uh, that's another video. Well sitting at 330 points now. And what's next? We have a CEO. It's the HNA Season 2 2022 CETO in Park. It's just a uh, light CETO. Quick hour to clean up around the park. And we're done. And we'll get some points for that. First group uh, out uh, collecting garbage, and I'm just uh, sitting at the truck with the garbage bags for more people to show up and hand them up and greet. <laughs> so, what do we do with all the garbage? We have these garbage bins. And you think won't they hold a lot? But if you actually look down inside, their counters sunk about six feet into the ground. So, town just lets us dump in then. Couldn't ask for a nicer day for uh, a Cito. Another month and this will be turned into the Christmas panorama. So they already got a crane over there. Start hanging lights and bring in the displays. And winter wonderland. Another bag going in the trash. Well, over in Brantford, we found uh, four lab caches and we stopped to get a letter. So we're up to 405 points. Another letter box. All right, this is a mystery cache. So it's worth uh, 25 points, I think. Another mystery cache. Magnetic. Another 25 points. Well, it's November 1st. After that last cache, um, we're at 490 points on the Signals Labyrinth. So, um, get another cache and we're at 500. So, we're actually going to a celebration event on foggy, wet, Tuesday morning, uh, skipped out of work to uh, go deliver some uh, WWF World 
provide flash mob coins to some people that uh, were at the flash mob event and the coins didn't come in until after the event so that's next you can tell we're at the right spot by the uh, Ontario geocaching license plate we're at uh, Kaylee's restaurant in uh, Waterford and we've had a few events here all right nice little restaurant let's go in and see who's here nice little crowd I just walked in the door and I won something <laughs> Well, you got you know I got to go with the track. <laughs> Put that in your pocket. Oh, thanks. Well, there you go. I got to head back to work, and I uh, claimed the vent, so five and picked up a, a new geo, geo coin. So we're at uh, 510 points, which gave me the souvenir and mission accomplished for the uh, escape from the hedge. So, till next time, cash you later, cash you on the trail. All right, this is the coin I won at the event, and I had a choice, and I gotta go with the tracking coin. Uh, this is uh, this Tasafio 10-year uh, celebration of geocaching, and she's a local geocacher. Um, with over 40,000 finds and this is her personal coin so uh, nice to have a, a new coin for the collection if you want to discover this uh, it'll be in my mail call video coming up